haven't read it, here's a battle for the ages. Probably it'll be very laggy, but let's see how it goes. Um, it may have been a very bad idea to put in two of the enemy's fleets that are named, um, including a so-called Dreadnought, even though it looks like it only costs as much as a cruiser. Um, yeah, they have, you know, we're playing with this many blocks, quite a few blocks, uh, 175,000. Um, yeah, we got our battle cruiser. You know, our side, we got the battle cruiser, the Rhapsody, two of these hover tanks, the Whirlwind, Razor Wind, sorry. Uh, we got a gunship, the Leaf, um, we got support cruiser, the Melody, and there's supposed to be something else uh, here. We got the Cacophony, Siege Cruiser. And on the enemy side, they have one of these, which we've never seen before, but it's very good looking. It's a Granic, Granatic, Granat. Nick, bomb, dis bomb destroyer. Uh, it appears that they shoot bombs. Um, yeah. And over here they have the dreadnought, which also fires lots of missiles. It seems very beautiful ship. And behind there's another fleet, a bunch of units we've seen before. We got submarines, we got destroyers, and we got uh, attack destroyer, a nuclear variant. Ah, I see. Okay, so we gotta watch out for that. So they're firing shiny missiles, and we have missile interceptors and lasers. We haven't entered degraded mode yet, and we're firing crams on their biggest ship. You can see a lot of missiles coming at our siege cruiser from the other angle, uh, which isn't so good. And now we're in degraded mode. Um, what is the ship doing? Is it ejecting missiles up at us? Yeah, that might be it. The hover tanks in the action. We got the battle cruiser aiming at the dreadnought as well. Oof. Okay, we didn't. The crans didn't quite hit that center. Now the one problem with these missile systems is that hmm, the problem with these missile systems is that the actual explosive part of the missile can be quite small, so it's very hard to land a crit critical hit. Let's see. Have they launched their nukes yet? Or do they only do that within a certain range? Where is their nuclear one? Uh, it appears the nuclear launchers have detonated on the ship itself, um, so there's nothing for us to worry about. Okay, other than that ship, what's the biggest target? That has about 100 missile firepower, so let's concentrate on that with our anti-submarine specialist. Or rather generalist. Okay, the, we have exited degraded mode, degraded mode again. Hopefully we can see some explosions coming off of the ship. And just as I speak, we're in degraded mode again. Um, we've seen a lot of chunks on this ship. It still has a lot of firepower left though, even though I don't see it launching a lot of missiles. Okay, it's losing blocks very quickly, even though the game is running quite slowly. And we don't quite know what this destroyer does either before it's reduced to a wreck. Oh, two of those crenshaws went into the same spot, uh, attempting to cut the ship in half. That siege cruiser is a menace when it does work. Alright, looks like we're about to play in equal volume. Um, how's our damage? We have sustained light damage so far in this battle. They're definitely firing a lot of munitions at us, but ooh, it's about 80% at sinking. So if we can sink it, we can get it to despawn very quickly. Those packs are originally meant to be EMP when I designed the ship, so they can you know, disable some surface level components and detection, but uh, at this rate, um, they they're mostly for aesthetic, with impact damage. Okay, something exploded, but I don't know what. Could it be one of the submarines? Not quite yet. The 
There's a lot of missile ships here. Um, most of them are attracted to the siege cruiser for some reason, but the siege cruiser has decent-ish armor on the side, even though it is a glass cannon unit, but at least it uses crams, so those will keep functioning even with a slight amount of damage to the core components. They still have a lot of materials left, so we can probably sustain another fight of the size as well. Yeah. If not, wipe out the whole faction. I think that was a bit redundant. Uh, I'm sure the battle cruiser was just firing at the biggest target, but whatever. Oh, why did you do that? Engaging now. Engaging now. Okay, let's have a look at how cramps work underwater here. Mm, didn't seem to work too, too good. Or maybe I got the hose with the ship, I'm not sure. I knocked his butt off. And now it's on the surface. That's one of our hover tanks. Oh, this thing is one mate. It's after 80%, in fact 60%, it's not, still not sinking. Yeah, I'm curious why the siege cruiser went after that target. Could have easily went after the other one, which is much closer. Oh, look at that wharf. Just wasting off our materials. Hmm. These two are getting quite close to our battle cruiser, but doesn't seem to be an issue. Yeah, these ships are quite weak, and we can't let them get closer. Or maybe not. Engaging now. Yeah, you can get on our side, but I don't want you to be behind us. Alright, I think one of these is despawning, so that should free up some system resources to, to run this battle. No, I think that's one of the destroyers, and this one is a few seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Nope, two. Yeah, it's running slow. Goodbye. It's a very tough shove, but I'm still not quite sure what it did. Alright, alright. Let's just zoom out a bit and see where this battle is at. Got another thing. That's the ship that nuked itself. Alright, I think we can pull this thing out. It's, it is a resource hog. Um, the smaller units should be able to take care of that. And on the very other side of the map, we got these. Okay, I think I'll just let target prioritization handle itself. Oh, and I was facing toward our battle, his rear toward our battle cruiser. How's these gonna take rounds coming in? These ships are slightly better at staying float though, so not just sinking right away. Although I wish that they did. And all the way, way far, far over here, we have the Monsoon Melody bullying the ship that nuked itself. I'm 
he's probably gonna attack him from above, so doing a bit more damage to the internals. Still has engine power. Oh, come on, where's your AI at? These shots are built tough. Just look at the, these blocks getting deleted. Alright, those are sunk. And that's the last one. Man, this battle got really big in scale. In terms of, you know, just ships moving very far away from each other. Wow, that's a real good barrage. Still alive? Oh, this is about to be cut in half. Alright, this is a ship that didn't sink.